Hi students, welcome to yet another mathematics class, speed math class from your favorite channel, My Exam Coaching. Today, in this video, we are going to share with you a very, very important mathematics trick that is how to find the square of a number near to 100, that is base number 100. I'm sure this video will be very helpful for those students who are preparing for various competitive exams. Let us learn it. Finding square of a number near to 100. So, near to 100, what does it mean? Near to 100 means our base number is 100. Now, let us take a number, for example, to 97. 97 is a number near to 100. And you want to find out the square of 97. What way we will find out the square of 97 by using speed mass, Vedic mathematics. 97 can be written, 97 square can be written as 97 multiplied by 97. Then we will put a line like here. Then 97 is deviated from 100 by what? By minus 3. So we will put that minus 3 here. Again, 97 is deviated from 100 by minus 3. The minus 3 is here. Then 3 3's are 9. Since the base number have two zeros, we will write the answer here as a two digit number. So 3 3's are 9. So we will write 0 9 here. And then you have to cross subtract it. 97 minus 3. Cross subtraction. Here also cross subtraction. 97 minus 3 or 97 minus 3. What is 97 minus 3? 94. So, you can write 94 here. So, what answer you got? 9409. So, what is 97 square? 9409. This is the method to find out the square of any number near to 100. If you practice it, it becomes very easy. You can solve it even 2 to 3 seconds. Let us see. You want to find out 98 square. So, we know 98 square means what? 98, 98. I can put minus 2 here. I can put minus 2 here. And 98 minus 2, 96. 2 twos are 0, 4. So, I can write it as 9604. This is the answer of 98 square. You want to find out 95 square. What is 95 square? 95, 95. Deviation is what? 0, 5. Again, 0, 5. So, 5, 5 are 25. 95 minus 5, 90. So, your answer will become 9025. You want to find out 92 square. What is 92 square? Again, 92, 92. What is the deviation? Minus 8 minus 8. So, 8 eights are 64. Always remember, you have to write here two digits only. So, 8 eights are 64. 92 minus 8, 84. So, you are, what is your answer? 92 square will be 84, 64. This is the way you can find out the square of a number near to 100 and less than 100. Now, we will see how to find out a number which is more than 100. Suppose, we will take a number 104 and you want to square 104. So, what is the method? Method remains same. 104 means 104 into 104. Here, base number is 100. 104 is deviated from 100 by plus 4. So, instead of minus, we will take plus 4 here. Again, plus 4 here. 4 fours are 16. Here, in the last example, we have done cross subtraction. Here, we have to do cross addition. So, 104 plus 4, cross addition. 104 plus 4, 108. So, I can say the answer is 10816. Similarly, I want to find out 107 square. So, I can, without doing this, I can write now. 107, 7 is the deviation. So, 7 square will become 49. And that 7 is added with 107. 107 and cross addition means 107 plus 7. Seven. So, 107 and 7, 114. So, directly also I can write the number. If I do it using this method, the same answer will come. 107, 107. So, what is the deviation? Plus 7, plus 7. 7, 7s are 49. 
49 that I have written here first. Then when I do the cross addition, 107 plus 7, I will get 114. So I can do directly also. So I am sure you might have learned it. Without doing this directly by seeing, by observation method, even you can write the answer. So let us see. You want to find out 106 square. Tell me what is the answer for 106 square. 6 square is what? 36. So last two digit you got. Then cross addition, what will come? 106 plus 6. So what will come? 112. You want to find out the square of 103. 103 square. So 3 square will become what? 9. But remember, we have to write it as a 2 digit number. So 0, 9. And 103 addition, cross addition. 103 plus 3, 106. You want to find out the square of 109. So what will be the square of 109? 9 9s are 81. 109 plus 9. So 109 plus 9, 118. So this way you can continue. It is not, it is not uh, that uh, it will be applicable only for numbers very close to 100. You can even find out numbers, the square of numbers 120, 125, any number you can find out using this method. Okay. So I am sure this will be very, very useful for those students who are preparing for competitive exams. For more videos and more tricks like this, please subscribe to our channel and thank you very much for watching. Bye.